So I wonder how many more there are. I'm wondering if the government knows that this is going on, will they get in touch with the veterans that are alive and say, hey, we destroyed your file. We were irresponsible. One veteran in this thing is one too many. No veteran left behind. Do we need to hear the stories? Oh, yeah, we do. We do. Because you might not get all the stories. People not, might not come out and speak. And they might just want to hear and tell the stories in front of parliamentarians. Because when I seen Mike, he wanted to speak to somebody. I was very happy that a member of parliament sat there and listened to him. I'm not in the military. I might not know everything from the military, but I know when I see hurt. If you don't listen to that hurt, unfortunately, you haven't done your job. And I intend to do mine. 27,381 boxes of medical files were destroyed. Not only that, they were in a rush to destroy them. Hello? Okay, on that note, we were going to call it a night. I think we've all been sitting here for a couple hours. I think the uh, dialogue's been very exciting, uh, sitting back and listening to the quality of the questions and the quality of the answers. I'd also like to take a very special moment to uh, thank Michelle Grappo for answering the Patriots call, for stepping up and taking considerable amount of time <laughs> to prepare the brief that was done tonight. We video recorded it. Hopefully uh, we'll be sending it to every MP that could make it tonight so that they are aware of the situation, so that we, our voices will be heard. And also take special thanks for uh, Sean Brouillet thrown into the breach again. Uh, you'll notice that the government did not send a lawyer to speak to the Equitus. And out of fairness, I did not think it was appropriate that uh, Equitus had a lawyer come in from Montreal. There were issues there, and I think believe in fairness. And I believe that uh, Michelle Drapeau has presented the foundation on what we need to know to proceed forward in good faith on all levels. Uh, on conclusion, I'd just like to thank Lori Hahn for stepping up. I, uh, pr I appreciate that. Uh, you may not know this, but uh, Lori and I, we've had uh, some email conversations going and some good banter in the House of Commons and and I've always found them uh, willing to listen. We may not agree on certain things, but you know, it, it's testimony of a man who is willing to listen to an adversary, especially someone goofy like me when I get in their faces. So I think it's pretty good. Uh, special thanks to Peter Stauffer uh, for coming with three members of the NDP. Uh, we're very grateful that you could come. So put your first name again, brother. Burry. Murray and of course Jimmy K down there. Jimmy Kerry Gannis, the lovely Margot has come to join us. And on that happy note, uh, I just want to thank uh, Jerry Colbacks wherever he was for uh, doing the groundwork to get this going today. Sylvain Chartrand for doing the video. And every one of you who have come out today, who have listened, who have participated in something that I think is very special. Uh, so my thanks to you. God bless you all. God bless this nation. The bar is open. Thank you.